What is Native Instruments Thrill? Well, they call it a real-time cinematic tension instrument. And what does that mean exactly? Well, you know when you sit in the cinema with your popcorn in one hand and a soft drink in the other, and you feel a strong emotional build-up in the movie. Tension is starting to rise and you almost sit frozen as you get prepared for what is going to happen next. That's when the composer and the sound designers of the movie use sounds like the ones in Native Instruments Thrill. These kinds of sounds can have all kinds of styles, but the main theme is dissonance. A character of the sound that makes you uneasy. Alright, so now you know what Thrill is about. Let's jump straight into the most important part, the sound. I will do a quick sound demo for you now. And here is a friendly warning. These sounds can be quite harsh, so have your volume control ready. Alright, here is Native Instruments Thrill. So that was part one of the sound demo, because this library is divided into two parts. Sounds without pitch, that are basically soundscapes, which are called atmospheres, and sounds with pitch, which they call clusters. You just heard some examples from the clusters sounds. Now here's some sounds from the atmospheres section. Alright, now I will do a quick rundown of the user interface. The user interface has this really sleek black and white and kind of scary look that goes well with the kind of sounds this library can produce. It is divided into four pages. Page 1 is the main interface. This is basically the quick and fast controls for each preset. Page 2 is the source page where you can switch out and control two sound sources for each preset. Page 3 is the effect page, where you can shape your layers with different effects. And page 4 is the master page, 
where you can apply effects on the master output such as EQ, saturation and compression. And here is also where you assign the MIDI CC channels for the XY controller so that you can record the most important performance part of the Thrill instruments using your MIDI controller. To be honest, the single controller you will use the most is the XY pad. And it is available on all four pages. It is actually super simple to understand and use as well. The X axis controls the blend between the two sound sources, like this. And the Y axis controls the amount of tension, like this. Alright, that was my quick sound demo and overview of Native Instruments Thrill. This is a very niche sound library and there are not many options out there for a similar sound and control. With most other libraries that features dissonant and scary soundscapes, you often have no or little control over the timing of the tension building up or the character and blend of sound sources. I also personally like that this library is mainly focused on real orchestral sounds. I very much like the overall sound and ease of use of this library. Basically, all you need is to choose a preset and have fun with the XY pad. So if you are a composer that needs to add tension in your soundtracks, or if you are a sound designer who needs scary sounds in your arsenal, this library is great. Now here is my overall review score of Native Instruments Thrill. Sound and quality 4.8 User interface 4.7 Features and control 4.5 And inspiration factor 4.6 Now I also have some constructive feedback because no software is perfect and I always keep my reviews honest. So here are a few points I would like to address. 1. The CPU usage seems to be quite high, at least from what I experienced. A bit too high in my opinion, especially since it is based on sound samples. 2. I would like to have a release control easily accessible for the total sound, because sometimes I felt I liked the sound, but the decay and release was too long. Many times you need a more sudden stop so a release knob just below the XY pad would be great. And three, one effect I would really like to add inside this library is some kind of stutter and glitch effect. I find that glitches works great for these kinds of creepy sounds. Please give this video a thumbs up to support me and get more videos on sample libraries, VST plugins and all kinds of music production tech reviews and demos for music makers like yourself. I truly appreciate your support. I'm Mike, signing out, and you rock, my friends. My name is Mike, and I share my story and journey as a music composer and sound designer to inspire creative people like you. So click that subscribe button to gain music superpowers.